what's up guys it's your boy quartz up here and i'm gonna be showing you guys how to parry perfectly in type soul so type soul did just re-release and it actually came out with a new ranked mode so yeah being able to parry is very important as you know it's really helpful in pvp and ranked as well now my method for actually getting better at parrying is actually going to heiko mundo so yeah whether you're a soul reaper get a friend to guard gan to you or there is like another way too i think through squad missions and if you're a quincy just do the same thing as well okay now that we are in heiko mundo i want you to go to any hollow and have them attack you now what i want you to do while they're attacking you is i don't want you to fight back or anything what i want you to do is i want you to try to parry every single time whether it's a small hollow or a big hollow the reason why i want you to do this is because of parry timing now, parry timing is very, very important in type soul as it determines whether you're able to parry certain abilities. For example, if you're fighting a speed build in type soul, that is probably the best thing to know how to parry, especially because they have fast moves. If you get your parry timing down against speed, you can parry all their moves very easily. Say you're fighting in a wrong card that has granary arrow, same thing It's timing your parry at the right time of impact. What I want you to do is I want you to actually go next to those specific hollows and I want you just to let them hit you. It doesn't matter if you die to the hollows or anything like that. I want them to hit you and I want you to keep parrying every single hit. Now, what I want you do is i want you to parry 10 times in a row two times on the hollows and then that's when you'll know that your parry timing is perfect now by 10 times in a row i mean doing it 10 times in a row without getting hit in between now heavy attacks do not count but yeah you just want to keep doing that until your parry timing is good now another thing i would do after that is i would actually get a friend who is a speed build or just any other build and i want you to fight them and i want your sole focus to be just a parry you can have them attack you how much you want and make it so as they're fighting you all you're doing you're not fighting back or anything you're just parrying so you get so good at parrying to the point where whenever someone tries to shoot anything at you it's an easy parry the last method i would have for actually getting better at pairing in type soul as well would actually be going into rank and actually fighting people there's a lot of experience really helps too especially with different builds uh but it's not that hard to get into pairing once you get the parry timing down that's why the parry timing is so important so yeah i would for sure recommend doing that as well so this is pretty much a quick video to help you guys on pairing and everything like that as well if you guys do have any other suggestions or questions feel more than free to put them in the comments down below so yeah make sure to like subscribe for more type soul content and yeah it's your boy court signing out peace